there's a small wall in front of you, a long pathway that leads around. How would you circumnavigate this urban obstacle? For Cosa Seniors Gunnar Robinson and David Lopez, it's a simple answer. Jump over it. What may seem like a rebunctious child's heaven, this obstacle-filled building is Tempest Academy, a free-running oasis hidden on the outer edges of the South Bay. Free-running, also known as parkour, is an obscure sport focusing on the art of getting from point A to point B in the most efficient way possible. However, people come to Tempest for an array of reasons, from training for diving competitions to becoming stunt devils. I come here to challenge myself and get over my fears. Some of my biggest fears are heights and flipping over my head. And those have always really scared me. And coming here, I'm able to work with pads and equipment that makes that easier to get over. So that's, that's the main reason. Also, it just is really cool. I come here to test the limits of my, my body. The human body is amazing, and I just want to see what I can do with it. And getting over my fears is definitely one thing that helps me in life, knowing that I can achieve things. Although it is a rigorous athletic activity, free running requires more than an elite physical shape. It calls for a certain mindset not seen in any other sports. In the eyes of a free runner, the surrounding environment morphs into a navigable obstacle course, and it is their job to maneuver it as efficiently as they can. To become a free runner, you really just need the will and dedication to do it. Everyone's here to support you, and really anyone can do it. You just need to believe in yourself. It sounds cheesy, but you, you really do. And you need to know that sometimes you're going to land on your face and it's going to hurt. But you get over it and uh, you overcome. For Robinson and Lopez, Tempest Academy offers something greater than a method of exercise. The ninja-like skills they have developed, topped off by a sense of communion within the Tempest family, makes the unique intrigue of parkour a passion for both individuals. I use it to kind of make my life a little bit easier because school is always hard for me so I like to kind of, it helps me relieve stress. It's just a nice way to exercise, relieve stress and meet new people. I love the people here. They're like your brothers and sisters. It's, it's like you're all family and that's really what it is. It's just one big family. A pseudo mix of gymnastics and track and field, this sport can truly be categorized as extreme. Fast paced and adrenaline filled, limitation is a word not present in the participants vocabulary. So what's next on the agenda for Robinson and Lopez? The next thing for me is skydiving. That's, that's my next achievement, especially to get over that fear of heights and realize that I have. Got to go skydiving. Yeah, for me, what's next is learning how to ride a motorcycle so I can go on motorcycle diary trips with Gunnar and my other friends and just have new experiences in the world. For La Vista Live and the Los Angeles Times' High School Insider, this has been Jimmy Shaw.